Hi everybody, I'm here today to talk to you about some of the new materials that we have in our 03 Cabrina Kite collection. The main differences between our kites would be in the leading edge materials. So I'm going to break the kites into three classes or frames and I'll explain the differences between those materials and what the benefits are to the rider. We'll start with our hybrid frame, which is the Switchblade, the Contra Ether, and the FX2. The hybrid frame uses high tenacity Dacron in the leading edge. We've been using high tenacity Dacron for a few years now. It's become more or less a benchmark in the industry. It's incredibly sensitive to steering and rebounds very well, and it's a great weight and a very good mix together with cost, and it's produced great products over the years. So that's high tenacity Dacron. That's our hybrid frame. Moving on, we have a light frame. Our light frame utilizes HTD light material in the leading edge. The kites that use the light frame are the Moto X, the Drifter, and the Contra. The benefits of using HTD light in the leading edge is a 12.5% lighter leading edge. And what this does is it increases the turning speed and responsiveness, as well as increasing the low end of the kite because it weighs less. We now move on to our Apex frame. The Apex frame is only on the Nitro Kite. This utilizes Ultra HT leading edge material. Ultra HT material turns about 15% faster than our HTD light leading edge kites. So with Ultra HT, you have a material that twists very easily, but wants to snap back to its original position. Not only that, but it will retain that original manufactured shape for a much longer period of time. And not only that, but Ultra HT is very easy to repair. It is not a crazy exotic material, so it can be repaired anywhere. So what you have with Ultra HT is a lightweight material that has great rebound and recovery and will improve the steering on the kite. Now across all kites, we have a number of improvements in materials, and we'll start with the struts. All the struts across all kites use HTD light material. And like I said before, that's 12.5% lighter than high tenacity Dacron. We also have removed all the two plies on the kites. Two plies were two layers of canopy material stacked to improve durability. What we've done is introduced a new heavier weight canopy material that is plenty durable and lighter and it frees up the kite to move better in those locations where we had two plies in the past. We've also changed out the scuff guards. So our new scuff guards are lower profile, they're made from TPU, they're more durable, they're stronger, and they're lighter. So this is a very nice improvement along the leading edge of the kite. Now on the trailing edge of the kite, we've also removed any hard battens and they've been replaced with EVA battens. EVA battens are soft, extremely durable, and virtually impossible to break. And that covers everything in our 03 kite range all these materials and why we have them there and what the benefit is to the rider in each different case of each frame. Thank you.